Life is full of decisions. What is true for us is also true of PLCs. Say, if the tank is full or the button is pressed and there are NO alarms then start the process. You'll notice that this condition involves three types of comparisons, and, or, and not. Now we could get more complex but all that we'd be doing is using these simple building blocks. A series of graphical objects have been used for years to represent these logic elements and they can be easily converted to a common ladder logic equivalent. These functions are also called gates as they act like gatekeepers for different logic. NOT gate In electronics, NOT gate is also called an inverter or buffer. NOT gate works as inversion. It takes one input and gives one output. When the input is high then the output is low and vice versa. By using just one normally closed contact, not logic gate can be implemented in ladder logic. The input is normally closed, and it is in series with the output. And gate. In in gate, when both inputs are high then the output will be high. For all the other inputs, the output will be low. And gate can be implemented in ladder logic by connecting normally open contact of inputs in series. Suppose we have two push buttons as inputs and a lamp as output. When both push button P1 and P2 are pressed, which mean that both inputs are on, then and then only output goes high. In the case of both push buttons are not pressed, the lamp won't be on. In another case, if any of the push buttons are pressed then the lamp won't be on. OR GATE If both inputs are low in the OR GATE, then the output will be low. For all other cases, the output will be high. OR GATE in PLC ladder diagram By connecting the normally open contacts of the inputs in parallel, OR GATE can be implemented. Now if we have two push buttons and a lamp, if any of the push buttons P1 or P2 are pressed, then the lamp will be on. Thanks for watching.